Hey everybody, Hannah had reached out to her family, so I wanted to give you guys a case update. So here it is right now. Show about the Hawaii woman who gone missing at LAX. Tonight, her family says she's been found safe. Remember, Hannah Kobayashi was reported missing exactly one month ago today, prompting a massive search. Her family said she missed her connecting flight from LA to New York City, and there have been concerns over her safety after security footage showed her with a man her family didn't recognize and was then seen crossing into Mexico. Maya Eaglin is uh, joining me now. Maya, what more can you tell us about this latest development? You know, police had stopped their search for her earlier this month um, because they thought she was went missing voluntarily. So does that seem to be the case any longer? Yeah, Gabe, as you mentioned, police do believe that she went missing voluntarily. We don't know exactly where she is, but we did receive a statement from her family today which said, quote, we are incredibly relieved and grateful that Hannah has been found safe. This past month has been an unimaginable ordeal for our family, and we kindly ask for privacy as we take the time to heal and process everything we've been through. We want to express our heartfelt thanks to everyone who supported us during this difficult time. Your kindness and concern have meant the world to us. Again, no details on exactly where she is at this moment, but let's recap to how we got here. On November 8th, Hannah landed in LAX, but missed that connecting flight to New York City. We do know that on November 11th, she returned back to LAX to get her bags and had some communication with her family members. On November 12th, her family filed a missing persons report, where authorities, again, later reclassified that as a voluntarily missing person. Then on November 24th, police say her father had been found dead after committing suicide near the LAX airport. Fast forward to this past Monday, police discovered that Hannah actually crossed into Tijuana, Mexico on foot. And that brings us to today, where we received a statement from her family, again, asking for privacy as they continue to put these pieces together. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the so please remember if you give her family privacy hit the like button comment below and share this up have a great night love you all